Hello, I am Brittany. I'm the teen librarian at North Riverside Public Library. This is Thor, and we are both going to be reading to you Just Say Please by Gina and Mercer Mayer. Having manners is very important, and this is going to teach us what they are. My teacher said that good manners are important. She also said that everyone in our class could use a little help with good manners. We made a good manners chart. We took turns telling the teacher what to put on it. I said, cover your mouth and nose when you sneeze. My dad told me that. The teacher said that was a very good one. The class went over everything on the list, one by one. Remember to say please. I remember to say please when I want to stay up past my bedtime. Remember to say thank you. I always remember to say thank you when I get what I want. Take turns. I take turns most of the time, but sometimes it's so hard to wait. Don't interrupt when someone is talking. I guess that's why mom gets so mad when I talk to her while she's on the phone. Thor and I have a hard time waiting. He always wants cookies and so do I. Share. I didn't know sharing was good manners. I wonder if my sister knows about that. If you bump into someone or step on someone's toe, say excuse me. I guess that keeps people from getting mad at you. Don't put your elbows on the table. I didn't know elbows were bad manners. Say you're sorry when you do something wrong. I'm not too good at that. Put your napkin on your lap at the dinner table. I thought that was just so silly. Thor and I need to practice putting napkins on our lap. My teacher said that we would go over the list every morning so that we could tell her what we did to show good manners. I thought that was neat. I decided to have good manners right away. When I got home, I ran in the front door and knocked my sister down. I said, excuse me, that didn't help. She cried anyway. I went to tell mom, she was talking on the phone. I forgot I'm not supposed to interrupt when someone is talking, so I said sorry. Boy, was she surprised. She didn't even get mad at me for interrupting. When dad came home, I asked him to play a game with me. He said he was too tired. I said please, but he still said no. I guess good manners don't always work. That is where you should be patient, right? At dinner, I put my napkin on my lap. My sister asked me why. I said, because it's good manners. Then my napkin fell on the floor. My sister said, you dropped your good manners. And there it is, covering the little mouse. When mom passed the rolls, I remember to say thank you. Mom said my teacher was doing a great job teaching us good manners. I even remember to keep my elbows off the table. Dad didn't though. After dinner, I let my sister color my homework picture. I thought it was nice of me to share my homework, but I don't think the mom thinks so. The next day at school, we went over the good manners list. We each told how we used good manners. Only one other critter in my class had better manners than me. She got a big sticker that said, I have good manners. It was cool. I'm working really hard to remember my good manners because my teacher gives out a sticker every day. And I love to get stickers. Even the mouse has a sticker because he was sharing. The end. I think Thor and I are going to start making our own little manners chart. So maybe you guys too, we can compare. So have fun.